we have been posting a lot of tutorials online I think above uh, 80 tutorials how to customize uh, Linux Mint and now we're going really into details how to adjust your Linux Mint the way you want I was making articles for Eric Dubois at uh, a website and um, from time to time I take screenshots and there is this uh, GNOME screenshots program if you press this button or you just type in screenshot then you will see the program and I have a shortcut Control shift escape which just opens the system monitor just sort it to ID and the last thing you run is on top there so it's called the GNOME screenshots because it actually doesn't say it it's a screenshot so the program that's the name the thing is when I make a screenshots for the website and, he, and you do take screenshot, it's all good, but it used to be in PNG. So PNG is like two megabytes, three megabytes, but putting those online on my website, well, <laughs> my web space will quickly run out. So that's not a good idea. So what did I do then? I thought, well, yeah, no problem. I know GIMP, so I go to GIMP and I export as GPG uh, and 90% um, um, loss, or say, uh, you can make it smaller, compress it to 90%, and everything was okay. But I had some time over now. I said, this should be more, should be easy to, to do that. Some program must exist, and indeed, it's quite easy, but it's quite complex. So that's why this little movie, it is now standard GPG. There is no way you can change it into the program. You have to do a workaround. So I explain it to you how I did it. First up, Ctrl Alt T. Let's go to the terminal. What I did is to install sudo apt install the dconf and then editor both of these so let's take the cli command line interface node so this one and this one take these two that's one you will say latest version everything is okay i should delete some stuff let's do it now otherwise every time in every movie already i have uh, shown it so move nah. Yes, get rid of it. That's that. So, I have two programs now. It's the one up here, dconf editor. Okay, let's open it. It's, let's say, not quite, probably not quite correct in saying it. It's a kind of database, but it actually is a kind of database. And it has apps inside it, and all programs have a little place in there. And you have, the only thing I have to do now is try and figure out where is this screenshot um, where is it somewhere now, there are also things I've found in cinnamon which I've put on the github of Eric Dubois the ultimate Linux Mint 18 cinnamon uh, installation and there you see it in some of the in one of the folder or so but this exercise is the question can I save it not as PNG but as GPG okay so dconf editor has a find so we figured out with ctrl shift escape it's my personal shortcut for system monitor okay so in the system monitor you found out that that is the name and then you type screenshots next 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 and here we find something standing there GNOME screenshot default file type GPG. Now you can do this manually. That's fine. You can change it from bitmap GPG PNG TIFF. Even worse, TIFF. So I want to have a GPG. Done. Save. Okay. Then I come to another computer and I said, oh god, it's not it's not done. It's not set. And then you have to figure out, oh no, I have to figure out again how was it again? So no. Is there a way to actually 
change it via terminal so we can have it somewhere. Yes, and that's why you installed dconf slash or minus or uh, CLI. That's the interesting part. And I think it's still open, probably somewhere up here. This is what you should do. G settings, a word you should remember to Google it properly. G settings, set org, gnome, gnome screen, screenshot, and so on. So I just figured it out myself. Why? Of, of why, not why, but how? Well, org, org, gnome, you know. Gnome screenshot, Gnome screenshot. So this is all in one word with the dots in between, org, Gnome. And here is a space bar, nothing, a space in between. And then you get the name here, default file type, type, type sorry. And then a space again. And then you set whatever you want. GPG, BMP, TIFF. So that's it. So what did I do? You can download it from the internet, but in the map data in online Ultimate Linux Mint 18 Cinnamon in the GitHub from Eric Dubois, there's a config apps and there's a GNOME screenshot. Set GNOME screenshot to save as a GPG. Just double click it. Ah, oh, that's a good exercise. Oh, I've closed it again, did I? Not a good idea. So, org. Gnome, Gnome screenshot, remember this little program that we made, a little script, you know what the script is, you saw what the script is, it's just a little line, G setting, set, org, blah, 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 GPG. So if we double click this, this is GPG, I'll try PNG first then, eh? there you go, it's changed to PNG. There you go, it changed to GPG. So next time I'm on, I'm on another computer or a new installation, I said, oh yeah, I have to change it. Just double click it and done. I thought that would be an interesting thing to share. Have fun.